Hi guys, good morning. Sorry for my oily face. Um, isashare ko lang po sa inyo kung ano po yung ginagawa ko pag gising ko sa umaga. Um, medyo late na rin po ako nagising today. It's already past 9am and it's a Sunday. So have a blessed Sunday to everyone. Share ko lang po sa inyo yung book na binabasa ko every morning when I wake up. Um, ito po yung Turning Points by David Jeremiah. So, um, nakahiligan ko lang din pong magbasa nitong book recently because um, na-inspire ako sa mga nababasa kong um, stories and related sa mga buhay-buhay ng mga uh, individuals in the past. So, I hope um, everyone could also try doing this every morning. Nakaka-refresh po siya, nakaka-inspire. At the same time, um, may makukuha po kayong lesson. So, for today, the date today is August 25. So, yung topic is all about courageous faith. So, babasahin ko lang po sa inyo yung thought for the day. Ito po yung Be Strong and of Good Courage. Do not fear nor be afraid of them. For the Lord your God, He is the one who goes with you. He will not leave you nor forsake you. That is in Deuteronomy 31.6. When Martin Luther stood before his accusers at the Diet of Worms in Germany, On April 18, 1521, o ba diba? ang tagal-tagal na neto, 1521 pa, he epitomized courage. My conscience is captive to the word of God, he declared. I cannot and will not retract anything, since it is neither safe nor right to go against the conscience. I cannot do otherwise, here I stand. May God help me. Amen. Martin Luther's courage and resolve were like those of Daniel, who profound himself captive in Babylon. As a teenager, Daniel was put on a fast track to become a scholar in Nebuchadnezzar's court. When given Babylonian food to eat, he took a stand. The food violated Israel's dietary standards and had probably been offered to idols before being served. Fortunately, he suggested an alternative diet that increased his health and his reputation for wisdom. When your convictions are challenged, suggest a creative alternative. But before you do, make sure You have the courage to back it up in case the answer is no. So meaning to say you, always, you need to prepare. You should have plan A, plan B, or plan C for in any case that may happen that you, are, that you did not expect to happen. If you are going to have, if you're going to have courage, you must, have, you must first have a conscience nurtured by conviction. So the thought na sinabi dito sa binasa ko, um, being, be, being a courageous person, we should not fear nor be afraid of them. Sabi nga, kasi kasama naman natin si God every day and He's the one who goes with us and He will never ever leave us nor forsake us for whatever we do for as long as we're doing it for the God's will. So, um, Yun, um every morning I I started to read this type of uh, thoughts um food for thought para naman uh, ma-inspire ako o di kaya naman meron akong magiging um wisdom sa pang-araw-araw na gawain na maiisip mo na God is really there God is always there and God will always provide for everything that we need so I hope Um, sa na-share kong um, idea sa inyo um, try nyo ding magbasa ng ganitong book nakaka-inspire talaga siya at may encourage kayo na um, malaman at mapalapit 
at maging strong pa ulit yung faith ninyo kay God. Thank you so much for watching and also another book that I tried to read every morning is this one. Ito yung um, The Purpose Driven Life Expanded Edition What on Earth Am I Here For? by Rick Warren. So, isa siya sa mga best-selling author was actually the number one New York Times best-selling author. Napakaganda niya, guys. I'm already, um, I just started the other day. I'm already on day three. Um, topic is all about what drives your life. So, kung may mga taong, kung meron man sa inyo na medyo nalolo moral or medyo um, hopeless, Um, kagaya ko, um, unti-unti ko pong na-build yung hope ko and then yung courage ko to to fight stress, to fight um, yung mga problems and pressures in life na maaaring makapag-down po sa atin. So, ito po siya. You can buy this uh, in any national bookstore. Mura lang po siya, guys. Ito sa national bookstore ko rin po siya nabili. And... Um, very inspiring. It's a devotional book, actually, yung kay Rick Warren. So, I hope um, try nyo rin basahin ito. Um, nakakagaan ng loob at the same time, um, yung faith natin talaga is mas strengthen enough to face all the challenges in life. Thank you so much for watching and I hope um, sa mga bago sa channel ko, you please uh, like, share, and then subscribe to my channel and please click the um, bell button para ma-notify kayo sa mga next videos na i-upload ko. Thank you so much guys and have a blessed Sunday again. Bye-bye!